Hello, so it is Tuesday today and I'm moving back to uni. I go to uni in Manchester and this is actually the last time I will be moving back, which is crazy. It's absolutely flown by. I cannot believe I'm in my last term of first year, which is crazy. Now, when I move back from uni for like the holidays, for Easter, for Christmas, I literally take everything with me, which is so unnecessary. It is ridiculous. So it's basically as good as a move in to uni vlog, like for the first time. The only thing that I leave there is literally my mattress and like decor bit. So yeah, today I'm going to be bringing you guys with me to move back um, to Manchester. You guys haven't seen my accommodation yet and it is like renowned for being one of the worst like uni accommodations you can get in the UK. So you'll get to see that. It's definitely been a culture shock compared to my bedroom. Like I'm very lucky. The room, it's a mess. It's a big mess. But I'm very lucky that my room is quite big this room is not so um yeah it's been it's been interesting i just need to pack and get ready it's actually quite late on in the day it is five to one so it does take about two and a half to three hours to get to manchester so i'm not going to get there till quite late so i need to stop rambling and get packing asap just to show you guys my outfit i'm having to actually film on my big DSLR camera as I actually dropped and smashed my vlogging camera in Florence which is so annoying. Shoot me to the side so you can't see the mess but this is my outfit. This top is just from Urban and then I'm wearing these kind of like flared Joni jeans from Topshop via ASOS. So yes, this is the kind of very summery fit we've got going on. So this is actually a little bit of a secret door. It kind of blends in other than that. Um, it's really messy, but I'm gonna go and grab some suitcases out from here so that I can take my clothes with me. A little life hack for you guys, which I actually learned from my boyfriend. It's either genius or stupid. When you pack your clothes, try and leave hangers on. It takes up so much more space in your suitcase. Then when you get to the other side, you can literally just pick it up and put it in your wardrobe. And that's what I'm going to be doing. Okay, so we've readjusted. Tops wise, I have all my tops out, like general tees like this. I've still got a lot of jumpers and stuff that may need to come with me. But I'm kind of preempting just hot weather. So I'm feeling like we don't have to take as much as maybe last time. But yeah, I'm just gonna try and fold all of these and put them in the suitcase once I've got all my clothes out. Mm. Okay, this is the current situation. I think these are all the clothes that I'm gonna take with me. Oh, I forgot my gym clothes actually. One sec. Okay, there's my little pile. I'm gonna try and pack these into two suitcases. This is ambitious. Oof. I'm a bit sweaty and hot now. Change of plan, I'm not taking this pink suitcase anymore. I've taken this red one instead. This one's better as it's so deep and big. I will show you guys. Can you see how like wide that is? I need to carry on getting ready. I'm just gonna go ahead and get my like tech stuff together. So essentially I have this little box here which goes under my bed at uni and as you can see I've got like camera equipment in there um, and I'm basically just gonna pop like hair stuff in there like any kind of electrical stuff I kind of just leave in this box and I'm taking my mirrors with me so yes that's what we're up to right now and time mm, the time is now 20 to 2 so we're kind of like running later and later into like a leaving late which is what I didn't want to do so I'm going to try and be really quick getting the last little bits together I'm going to pack up my makeup stuff and like beauty things as well and just try and get those all together in the next 20 minutes because I don't want to leave later than two my friends are all meeting at like a pub garden at four so I don't think I'll make it for that but I kind of want to meet them there if possible so operation move quick is now a go. Okay, so it's now five past two and I'm pretty much done. I basically shoved and filled this backpack full of toiletries, like everything. This is filled to the break of different bits and bobs. So I appear to have lost my glasses. Like I've not been able to find them for the past um, couple of days. So I don't know if I left them in a hotel that I stayed at like two weeks ago. I'm gonna need to ring them up and double check that I've not left them there because if not, then I have got no idea where they are. Yeah, I don't really know. I'm gonna look under my bed one more time and see if they've fallen there. But if not, I think I'm pretty much done. I'm so sad to be leaving those gorgeous flowers. So yeah, that's good because it's two o'clock and I wanted to leave by one. So we're only an hour behind schedule. I don't think they're here. Shit. Um, and also my contacts don't appear to be like, it doesn't look like I've got that many contacts left. I put on this really old MAC lipstick called Modesty, which I've honestly not worn for years. Um, but I actually quite like it. Like I literally just put it on. So I might take it with me. 
I'm just gonna go ahead and bring everything downstairs and then I can collate all the little bits and bobs like I've got my jewelry box the mirrors um, I've got some food um, to pop into kind of like a carrier bag and then I think we're good to go okay so all packed up everything's brought downstairs this is kind of like the pile we've got going on I'm breathing heavily because I've just dragged it all downstairs it's not that much but it's probably still a bit excessive I've still got my large LED mirror to bring down and pop some food in a bag um I'm gonna miss my doggies there's one in there hi yeah they're so cute say hi So I've switched to my phone. My mum's boot isn't actually the biggest. So I've got the suitcase, the kind of like technology box there and those two and then in the back seats. And then I just put my mirror and this kind of like miscellaneous box and then my uni bag in the back seat. So we ended up leaving around quarter to three and we got there about half five. So we made really good time on the motorway. And my room was definitely a mess when I moved in and started unpacking. Um, but it was very quickly sorted out. Okay, this quality is probably shocking, but I've just got to my flat. As you can tell, um, people can see me vlogging, which is really embarrassing. Um, it's 10 to seven, which is crazy. And also clearly because of how hot this room gets, the blue tack for my pictures must melt, which, you know, not really the one, but my friends are at the pub. So I'm gonna go and try and meet them before they all leave because they have been there since half three and it's now six. So I might be able to go and catch them for one drink, have a quick catch up. Um, so I've kind of, basically I've unpacked this red bag and popped everything in here so tomorrow i probably won't have time tonight i might do later tomorrow i'm gonna arrange those into like tops long top dresses like make it more but organized and then put my mirrors up i just need to like connect them just like little bits and bobs like that i still got all of my like makeup and things in here which needs to come undone Okay, it's now seven and we're already back from the pub and they've obviously were there for a lot longer than I have. I've got this really bad chest pain in my chest, like it's so painful. I don't know what it is and it's kind of scaring me, but I'm going to kind of get sorted a little bit now in my room. I'm so sorry for how like awful this lighting is um, with my phone. I need to unpack my camera. So I need to sort out the pictures on my wall to make it not look like that. And I'm gonna unpack, um, I like toilet shoes, I've put my lights on and things like that and then I'm gonna make myself some food. Okay, you're on 0.5 so the quality is even worse but I've got loads of toilet trees here um, which I just kind of put a few things up here and then the rest in this kind of like caddy thing. And then I've got my brushes which I'll just pop in. You can see me? The little brush holders and then this is all the makeup I've brought with me. Um, in there which i'm just going to organize into this little section here so that's the plan yep so i've got a few bits of mobs there makeup brushes there these i need to put in my kind of like a spares um drawer which i'll show you a second makeup's kind of in here and then um a few bits in there in here i just pop spare things like fake tan extra wipes i've got some body scrub in there um like extra shampoo and conditioner I like to stock up so that you know I'm always sorted um and this just kind of lives underneath my bed my mom kindly earlier unpacked my jeans and like underwear and things and pjs into this kind of drawer unit and then this side is just kind of gym clothes and going out clothes which i just pop at the top of my wardrobe in these little like boxes so i'm just gonna fold them up and pop them in here holy moly the lighting in this room is atrocious like ridiculous it's now quarter to eight and i'm just actually finishing off a lecture as i have a workshop tomorrow at nine and i haven't yet had the chance to do um the prep for it so i just want to make sure i've got lecture notes at least and i've got about an hour left of this lecture and i listened to it in like two times speed so I've technically only got half an hour left to listen to so I'm going to do that really quickly and listen to that and then make myself some food and then get ready because me and my friends are going to go out tonight which I know I'm going to regret tomorrow when I've got the 9am and I'm literally in tomorrow 9 till 5 so it's going to be a long one and then I have my hockey social tomorrow night as well so straight back into the swing of things but yeah I'm just going to try and get this finished now. Hello so it's actually a couple of days later um as you can probably tell from a different nail colour and the chips it's, it's just all 
been very very hectic since I got back but the Tuesday night out was really really good it was such a nice day to come back and I'm so glad that I came back on the Tuesday as I was kind of deliberating coming back on the Saturday but not everyone was back then and when I came back like pretty much everyone was back so it was nice to just come back and then get straight back on into the swing of things. I also forgot to mention that I did pop to Aldi the day after I moved in as well and just did a little bit of a food shop. I think I spent about £25 but I got so much stuff and I've not done like a big food shop since. I've gone to get more like fresh stuff like um lettuce and fruit because that goes off a lot quicker so um i've basically unpacked everything in my room it's kind of how it usually is i'm gonna do a room tour for my next video so stay tuned for that but i'm gonna go ahead and sort out my wardrobe because i've still not done this yet as you can tell it's kind of like a bit heebie-jeebie and i want it like joggers smaller tops longer tops jumpers coats it's kind of loosely like that but it is a bit of a mess i'm gonna leave the bottom bit as is you can literally see my grubby going out <laughs> um shoes because most of the time i just chuck stuff in there and same with the top bit so as long as these bits are organized i'm okay so yes that's what i'm gonna do now i'm in these like this is my designated kitchen top it's from h&m i can't remember if i showed you um so i literally wear it whenever i go into the kitchen and then i literally i'm living in these joggers at the moment they're so comfy they're just from um urban and i love the color very spring like um so yeah i'm making myself a quick sandwich so i'm waiting for my toast to toast slash defrost um but yeah i'm gonna quickly organize those it's all done and dusted as you can see it's basically kind of like in high order i've got like jumpers jackets then there's more like longer sleeve tops short sleeve tops and like crop tops and then about here it kind of stops and then goes into like some dresses um these are just a couple of going out tops i have everything else in here it's just better to be hung up so i hung these up and then i've got uh trousers and jogs at the back so that's the clothes all sorted which is great i've just got some here so that's what i'm gonna get changed into for today uh, that's my room pretty much sorted and like all moved into i don't know if you can see but this eyelash because at uni i sleep with a sleep mask it's kind of like flattened my eyelashes down slightly i don't know how well you can see that compared to this side so it's really annoying i just feel like my face looks less Right, as that's all sorted, I think that pretty much draws the video to an end. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I'm going to be doing like room tours, like week in the life vlogs and things like that um, of my last few weeks as a first year student. And then I'll be back home and able to do like normal like summer content holiday vlogs like hauls and things because this room is literally not big enough to film a haul in like i don't know where would i stand here that's not exactly like the nicest of backgrounds i might do like a first year q a in my uni halls um so if you guys have any questions or anything then definitely let me know um but yes thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye